I am a fan of Moby, so... <laughs> looking forward to bringing Starlink to India as well. I am a fan of Modi, so, <laughs> so I have to say that. I can say he, um, he's, he's, he really wants to do the right thing for India. Uh, he wants to be open, he wants to be supportive of new companies. Um, and obviously, but in the same time, make sure um, it accrues to India's advantage, which is, uh, you know, obviously th that's the job. <laughs> I think there's, there's a tremendous amount of uh, potential uh, for all three pillars of the um, sustainable energy future. Uh, the, th the three pillars being uh, sustainable energy generation through solar and wind primarily. And obviously India is great for solar. Um, and um, the amount of land area you actually need to g generate enough uh, electricity to power India is, is very small. I, I believe it'd be probably let one or 2% of the land area of India. So it's, it's very doable. Um, and then you need to pair that with uh, stationary battery packs uh, because the sun doesn't shine at night and then you need electric vehicles and then you have a sustainable energy future and I think it will uh, uh, the, the interesting thing people will find is that this is a lower cost way to go as well And we're also hopefully looking forward to bringing Starlink to India as well. <laughs> so, you know, the Starlink internet, yeah. uh, which I think can be um, incredibly helpful for um, sort of r remote or rural villages where they perhaps ha either may have no access to internet or the internet is very expensive and slow. Mm -hmm.